Hi. <laughs> you like me? We're friends now? Oh, I see trash in the room. Oops. Nope. <laughs> there you go. Anyone else got trash? Oh, that was hidden trash. Got any trash? I think I have trash. Yep. There's hidden trash in the rooms. Can I hire a cleaner? Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Do you think that's why they left bad reviews? Because there's trash everywhere? I didn't know, I swear! Okay, how are we gonna raise the prestige level? Okay, we're at level three. So the prestige level goes up with anything, right? If comfort level and decorations go up. What if we put in a bathroom? Oh, I can't. I can only build comfort rooms here. I could maybe add furniture just to add more decorations and stuff. Make level the other... Yeah, I could level two the other rooms. That's true. There might be a couple things, though. Oh, the possum clock. That's expensive. The barrel is two. We could add some... I wish... I really wish I could get a couch. I would love to do a little couch, put some plants there. Some books. Coffee table. Honestly, I could just add, like, a barrel or two. Does that work? Yeah, someone gave me a tip. Yeah! Someone gave me a tip on YouTube. You don't have to drag like that. You can just right-click it and it quick buys it. So you just right-click. Put a small snake plant on it. Uh, I guess some books and another plant. And then a tiny table light. Let's put that in that corner. Put that there. Oh, well, I guess that's staying there now. <laughs> there. <laughs> did that give me points? It did, didn't it? So should we should make more beds. Two beds. Let's start with that, actually. Because it's going to be a tight fit, I think. Yeah. Let's, um, oh yeah, rotate. I'll put it against this wall. Do it like that. It's not, it's not pretty, but it'll work. Should we do it like that? Oh, we could. <laughs> Technically, it's better. <laughs> She has a bear to look at when she sleeps. Do we know where, what to do with the old beds? I guess part of me wants to keep them so it's quicker to set up a, a new place if we're out of money and we still have the old beds. Fourteen, two points. Ten, two points. Should I just buy... Three of those. Um, what did we say? Art. This is one. <laughs> this is one as well. I love the small bear painting. <laughs> okay, I can't afford it. I'm broke. Um, how about I put the tiny rug here? <laughs> And then we'll put the big ones in their rooms. Okay. That brought it up a little bit, didn't it? I 
think. Now I'm out of stuff though. Does this help at all? If I like put it against the wall here? Oh, it does. Oh, it does help. Oh, you just need to stuff this place full of everything. It's such a small room, though. <laughs> Not much is gonna fit in here. Well, I don't have much else. Um, that's good for now, though. I feel like it's definitely... Things are looking up. Whoa. They want 23. Oh, that's not gonna happen. I have 18. 18 is the highest I can do. This person wants 11, but 12 comfort. Oh yeah, that'll be good. Um, what else do we have? 16 and 13. 13 comfort. Okay. You can just do this one. Oh, and they leave tomorrow. Oh, shit. 10, 15, 13, 13. There we go. They can't. Their requirements are too high. I can't. I can't do it! We still don't know what the deal is with the diner, right? Yes, give me trash. I want it. Money, money, money. Why? Why did we stop? Building rooms? Oh, we can fix the thing. Yeah, that's true. This thing. Hmm. Incredible sample of modern art. One extra guest. Okay. Upgrade those rooms. Yeah. We can definitely upgrade the beds. Um... But yeah, we can also make more rooms. Did we just run out of money last time? Does anyone remember? Because why wouldn't we just put like two extra rooms here? Can I see? Yeah, if we put two here, the bathroom would reach as well. I hope we have enough. So, okay, wait. We need to make two new beds and then two more for the other rooms. So four. Four nice beds. Okay. And... Ooh, the cushioned foot dress. We haven't done that one yet. We should do it. Yeah, I have more than enough. Four of those. Oh, I only have three. Huh. I can't do it. Panels. This is the first time I've run out of materials. I'll make two. Now let's make some rooms. Oh, that's four. <gasps> no, that's gonna bother me. Make shared bedrooms. Oh, put two beds in one room? I don't think so. But I didn't think about that. Um, okay, let's put in furniture. Oh. There, that's it. Nice. Okay, let's just tell ourselves this is a deluxe bedroom. Has extra windows as well, so people can snoop. Uh, one there. Put one 
there, and one baby here. Yes. Okay, now we need to... We need more trash. Um... Because we need to get, like, rugs and everything. Okay. Does that fit? Yes. Okay. Um, let's move this one on the opposite wall. I really wish that would fit there. Okay. Just a big ass coffee table. Okay. So they're upgraded now, right? They're level two. But this mo the motel is level four. Dang it! I want that for the other other one. Why doesn't that fit? Coffee table? Yeah, we just made it to level 4. Like how you set up your motel. Oh, thanks. It's awful. <laughs> this room is 3 white, this one is 3 white, and this one is 4 white. <laughs> Honestly, they gave us a hard size to work with. At least it works with the bathroom being in the center. Just wake me up when the trash is here. Oh, maybe actually this place has new trash. But it's so dark, I can barely see. So E again? Does that take everything? That is easy. Oh, that is so much quicker. <gasps> oh my god. It's genius. Little do I know I'm actually pressing like delete all or something. <laughs> loot, loot, loot. Checking the mini map to see where it is. It's not trash though, but I'll take it. Is there something down here? It says there's a area exit here. Oh, it's a passage. Prospector gear. 1500 gold! Wait, I have that, don't I? Oh. How do we- where do we get it? Okay, we need lights. Should I just get these? Ten? Oh, these are nicer though. And they're three. Uh, one, two, three. I can't afford it. <gasps> Great! I'm broke! I only got one?! Damn it. Ha 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 ha! Yes! 1162 from four guests. Yes, eight new requests. Okay, what is the state of my place? I have nine hygiene, six, 25 decoration, 2513. This is my best room. 2513. Oh, they're all so low. Damn it, Dolores, you get the best room. Um, 14, wow. Yeah, I'm not there yet. Eight, Frederick. Two and four. You get the lousiest room. Three, four, six, two, three, seven, four, four, 14. Ooh. Three, four, two, Darren. There you go. Okay. Rooms are booked. All requirements? Yes. 
Ready. Amazing. Thanks to your hard work. How can I ever repay you? <laughs> Locate your nearest shark like agent and press the green button. Mm hmm. Okay, she wants something. Gotcha. Are there any new blueprints? No. You gotta give me stuff. What do you want? Build five level two bedrooms. I'm at four. I get a watch. Five level... Five level two bedrooms. Yeah, they're all level two. I just need one more. But where am I... I could move the door and put a room in here. It's a little tiny, but I could do that. It will be... It will be... In, in reach of the bathroom as well. <sighs> English. Level two bed. Make it. Vanity. Make it. Foot rest. Yes. Comfort. Bedroom. Here. Yes. There. Okay. A bed. A thingy. And another thingy. You want two windows? Hmm. Let's go with that. I like that. Okay. That's it. Yes. What do I get? Is it a watch? Yeah! Awesome! What does it do? Wait, do I actually get the ability to track time? Do I need to equip it or... Oh! Oh! Look at that! 12.38. Oh, I was going so fast. Ugh! I have a little watch here now. You're making your way all over the place, aren't you? My, I barely got here and you're right on my track. I'm following you. You better watch your back or I might build you a bedroom. <laughs> You seem to have made it to the little concrete island. Arguably, an oasis worse than the desert it's saving you from. This place used to host all sorts of people, but mostly those without a lot of time on their hands. One of them, a sailor, a captain. <gasps> Are we gonna build a boat motel? A father to three strong boys, he had a lot of unexpected stops to make. Some would say his work was hectic, hostage to the wishes of the sea. He would make the stop so often that he'd have a regular room all to himself. One would wonder, perhaps, why his room would also come with regular guests all to himself. Maybe he didn't like sleeping alone. I suppose when the frost of the sea frost of the sea follows you, even ashore, you curl up to any ember you can find. He kept the books on all maritime travel, even followed it to showed it to me once, and it was his pride and joy. The schedule like clockwork, the coordinates, the ships, their names. It was so fascinating that I couldn't help myself and stashed it under a wardrobe. And he never saw it again, and neither did I. <laughs> Came back here with a blind hope that the chaos spared his little book. But there was nothing but rubble and dust, not even a standing wardrobe to look under. If you happen to come across an old leathered book, do an old lady a favor, would you? I did find it already. I did! I thought it was a wallet. I forgot where we found it, though. You know, I never used to see any animals like you just roaming around. We were lucky to hear birds some days. Now you all seem to be running the place. Not that I'm complaining. You're probably more qualified anyway. And you do seem like you're getting things back into shape. This road used to be full of cars and buses. People chasing other people's problems. Something... or sometimes their own, but rarely. You never had time to look after yourself. 
Oh, there I go again, blabbering to a bear. What happened to all the people? If only you could blabber back and keep an old lady company. I love how the conversation always just like goes like completely... Um, how do you say that? Oh god, in Dutch we say langs elkaar praten. It literally means like talking aside each other. Like you go in different directions. They're having a conversation with each other, but they're both having their own conversation and not listening to each other. Talking past each other? Yeah, I think that's what I'm thinking of. Okay. Keeping company, but I'm not here to throw a pity party. There's hardly enough booze for that. <laughs> Thank you. Now if you'll excuse me, I'll have a long I have a long walk ahead of me. Okay. Where's she go? She's so cute! I'm sure we'll see her again at some point. <gasps> hey! Sabine, right? Yeah! Fancy meeting you here, mister. I figured something must have gone down south. Too many folks out of nowhere. That damn shark's got people coming in droves. I have to keep an eye out of the dam near the lake. So the barrier up to High Lake is open. If you make your way up there, look me up. I know the place inside and out. Ooh. New area up north? Ooh, High Lake Dark Grove. Okay. Um, was I doing anything else? The prestige for timber crossing. I guess this is good enough for now. It's not perfect, but I did check in people, right? Oh, bedroom five is empty. Uh well all of their requirements are pretty low. Two three seven. Okay, good. Now all the rooms are booked. You must now successfully complete the stay for 10 plus guests. Okay. <laughs> Just 300 coins. Sure. Oh! Uh, Sean and I started playing Nobody Saves the World. It's so fun. If you need another good co-op game to play with a friend or your partner, I recommend it. Especially if you liked um, Minecraft Dungeons, Diablo 3, like the top-down kind of games. Very, very fun. Oh, this place is doing so poorly. Do you think there's any trash in somewhere? I want to upgrade it, but... Did I get any trash? Oh, maybe the new location is trash. I don't really want to see it when it's dark, though. I want to go into the new area in daylight. Let's have a look. We'll just go to sleep as soon as we can. Sabine! Well, I'd never. Look who waddled their way up the windy road. <laughs> I would call it more of a wobble. <laughs> this used to be the prettiest place to spend a summer in. The soft wave of the trees and the wind, the calmness of the water. No wonder the captain built his vacation house here. I remember it had the most amazing garden. You could see it from the dam. Obviously, you weren't allowed anywhere near the place. You should check it out. It's just up the dirt road. I'm sure there's some fruit or something you can eat along the way. That is your main occupation, right? Eating fruit? I would never limit myself to just fruit. I'm going over the dam to my outpost. I'll see you around. Hmm. Protein. Consumed. Find someone who can help you in High Lake. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, trash. Let's sleep. So we can see it in daytime. 
Here we go. Now we're talking. Wait. I do see trash on the map, don't I? Oh, mushrooms. Oh, mushies? I'm just looking at the map, seeing what I can collect. Is there only someone up there? <gasps> Is an apple tree? Apples! Trash! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> What was that? I need to buy another bus sign. Oh, it's only 200. We should do that. Oh, the apple stays on the map. There's Shark Boy. I bet whoever this is, they are gonna want mushrooms. Excuse me, gotta get all the wood. Excuse me. Ooh, what's this up here? Oh. Julia, hi. No, this is the last time. You are not taking anything from the garden. Please, there's barely, barely anything left, and the potatoes aren't even in season. I didn't mean to barge. Oh, you didn't? Well, you did anyway. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to come off that way. I'm sorry, you'll just have to look for food somewhere else. Hey, I'll never say no to a warm, glistening potato. But that's not why I'm here. So stupid of me to assume. That's not even close to stupid. I'll tell you what. I'm Hank. I live in the thicket with my mom and two best buds. It's nice to meet you, Hank. I'm Julia. I don't get a lot of visitors. Well, I do. But they usually don't talk. They just take. And I don't have a lot to give. I'm not here to take anything. The opposite, actually. Oh, cute. Always caught by surprise, Julia the goat was the only remaining resident in this huge estate. She seemed very invested in her vegetable garden, but the rest of the property didn't concern her as much. <gasps> Do you think we're gonna work in the yard? The intense aroma coming from her house signaled a knack for cooking, a hunch reinforced by Hank's rumbling tummy. I was wondering if this old house was occupied. I think I could use it could use a fresh coat of paint. Well, it used to be. I guess not anymore. No one's been inside the old captain's shack in ages. Mind if I take a look? Only if you don't mind not going anywhere near my garden. Okay. Oh, is this where she lives? <gasps> so many nice items. Look at that divider. Ooh. Oh, I like it. Pillows. <gasps> nice rug. I want it. Steal it. Oh, look at that. Very pretty. Took his ear. I see a washing machine. What's this? Chamomile tea and linden tea. Are we gonna run a cafe? Hmm? <laughs> is that what I think it is? With her produce? That would be awesome. Okay, I think I got most of it. There's some wood. Oh, here. Ooh, what's that? Mint. We're collecting mint. Nice. So excited to check all the new things I can collect. <laughs> Trash, yes. That's a lot of water. <laughs> That's literally something I would say. <laughs> Oh, here she is! Barbara. For some people, growing older doesn't come with getting smarter. I want what they have. 
Oh, I'm so burdened with my intelligence. Oh, and there's Sabine. The woods are peaceful and quiet these days. A little too quiet. Oh, I can help with that. Cool. I only now just not noticed the water pouring out. That's cool. Some of these trees, like, move suspiciously. I don't trust... A tugboat? Whoa. Oh, I can fix it? Did I just hear a cat? Did you guys hear that? Did you hear, like... You can't pay your debt from the grave. You're, yeah. Huh. Oh. But you can't. Your children can. <laughs> that was a good one. Okay. Welcome to High Lake. The Amber Jewel. The Pride of the Valley. The Great Depression. And we're talking sunken landforms. Not just... Not your reasons for staying in bed. Someone's in a mood. The Golden Plateau. In geological terms, of course. Not your late teens. <laughs> Captain's Estate is a perfect destination for a premium development. Quaint, family-centric farmhouse is ideal for hosting dozens of loud, unfamiliar strangers. As always, a regrettable, regrettable minimum standard is required to open this location. Okay. Uh, let's start by clearing out the trash, as usual. There's an upstairs. Or is it downstairs? I can't see. The perspective is throwing me off. Is it upstairs? I don't even know how to look at this. It is an upstairs. And it's clean. Yes. Okay. Uh, I think so. Okay. Ooh, look how pretty. <gasps> Yay! So much nicer. Here we go. Cafe in the upper floor would be so cute. Oh, that would be great. It would make s for accessibility, though. It would be better downstairs. Area supports the development of outdoor facilities. Open air, untamed, raw experience. At the mercy of dangerous creatures and savage beasts. I do get pretty grumpy in the morning. <laughs> Closed off in a small area with a fence and a gate, of course. Of course! As you know, patron health and safety are our main concerns. Any outdoor expansions need to be certified by a forestry specialist. Failing to do so will deprive your more adventurous guests from the true experience of paying extra to sit outside. I think I know someone like that. Sabine, yeah. Okay, let's talk to our new friend first. Okay, she's not sleeping yet. Wow, the house never looked so clean. Is that the fresh coat of paint? It is. Amazing. I've never seen it sparkle like that. What is this place anyway? I'm still not sure you're not here for my potatoes. But if you really mean it, this is the captain's estate. And that old pile of rust and mold is the farmhouse. Well, significantly less rusty and moldy now. It used to be the biggest private property in the valley. The lady captain and little captain kids would spend every summer here, although he was never with them. He spent most of his time up the hill in the big radio dish building. Ooh. I met a shark that asked me- <laughs> I love the little tongue. I met a shark that asked me to help to get humans to come back. If you're here to rob me, you don't have to put on a show. <laughs> no, I mean it. There's people all over the place now. 
I think I could help rebuild the farmhouse and get people to stay here. Listen, Hank. I got a rug in my house that lies less than you. Wait, I mean it! I'm sure your dolphin friend is waiting. He's a shark! Okay, you've convinced me. Really? No. Okay, I can prove I'm not here to steal. Isn't there anything you need? I could go get it for you. I'm pretty great at that. Hmm, if it means you'll leave. I won't come back without it. Alright, there's a kind of plant that doesn't grow in High Lake. It's called sage. I use it in my teas. Oh. It doesn't grow in the light, so you won't find it out you won't find it outside the thicker woods. I suggest you look west of sawdust, but you shouldn't step foot beyond the barrier. If you have any sense. We certainly don't have to worry about that. Okay. Go to Dark Grove and find Sage. Have we been to Dark Grove? Oh, this must be Dark Grove. West of Sawdust. Okay. Ooh, so many things to do! I'm excited! Um, let's see. 10 plus guests, we're working on that. Um, talk to Sabine. Okay. Go to Dark Grove. So we don't actually even have to work on rooms yet. Let's talk to Sabine then. Oh, that's cute. Hmm. Something down here. This. Chamomile. Or do you guys say chamomile? Or do you say both, depending on where you live? Bought the game. Yay, shorty! It's very, very fun. Yeah, definitely can recommend. It's a lot of game as well. It's, it's a lot of game for 20... Oh, she's not here. A lot of game for 20 bucks. What are you looking at? Hey, big guy. What you up to? Looking for berries, refurbishing old houses. Just bare things. <laughs> I ain't got much you could work on here. Except maybe the old broadcast station up north. No one's got any use of that anymore. Actually, I had a thing I needed your help with. Oh shoot. Oh yeah, I forget. She she can talk bear. I ain't good at skimming plaster, but I can tell you which mushrooms will make you feel funny. <laughs> We're trying to give folks a more uh, outdoorsy experience. And apparently rolling in grass until the ground smells like you isn't part of that. I'm a little lost. Well, most people don't mind a little dirt on their butt or smoke in their face. But in limited controlled quantities. Tell you what. If you clear out a bit of space for a camping spot, I can get you some basic things to get started. How about it? Repair the campsite near the farmhouse. Wait, where is that? Wait. I destroyed the green. Oh. Herbs. Electronics pile. Oh, there's a lot of stuff up here. A monument. Oh, another monument. Wait, did I fix that? Oh, I need loggers tools. Okay. Let me go back real quick and buy a toolkit and a bus sign. So that we can at least get those two things sorted as well. Hey. Okay. Oh, I can take this again. Oh, it's just a wood. Hmm. Yes. There we go. I see. Okay. Nice. Ooh, very clean. Uh, okay, let's go find Sage. Oh, wait. Didn't we have to... Where are we now? High Lake. Oh, we need to go way too different. Oh, can we exit this area? Through there? I don't know. It's pretty. 
<laughs> yes, ma'am. It's ready. Good going. I'm almost done. I'm just missing a bit of fuel and I left my canister behind. Fetch me while I finish up. I think I have fuel. Key to the camping spot is to make it feel the greatest waiting room in the world. It should be relaxing and quiet, but just temporary enough. So that you don't overstay your welcome. I mean, you don't have to worry about that. Okay. No crafting. S'more station. Oh. Sitting log. Small campfire. Nice. Campfire is a type of special room that can only be built in certain areas outside. Perfect for the more adventurous guests who prefer a moonlight wiener over an open flame. <laughs> Fire seating object. Okay. Some guests specifically look for campfires during their stays. That makes sense. Okay. Oh, it is closed. Pinefall. Oh, five guests have completed their stay. Oh, we need to rebook. I bet you there's gonna be an upgrade at some point where you can just go online, online in the game, and just book people rooms wherever you are. Okay. I want to go to Sawdust. Is it open though? Oh, it is! Ooh! Spooky! Looks expensive. Is there something here? Bag of seeds. I heard spooky noise. Is this sage? Herbs. Mushrooms. Do you think stuff can attack me here? Mushrooms? Herbs. Mushrooms? Oh, it's getting pretty here. I got it. Well, nothing attacked me, so not too bad. Prospector gear again. Gotta say, soundtrack is very creepy. I don't like it. Oh. Is this gonna be like a spooky motel in the future? Oh, it's the possum! Hee hee hee, Gus! You again. I think we got off on the wrong foot and now I used up both. <laughs> I never meant to um say nice things about you. Yeah, well, you can't just do that to people. You could ruin someone's day. But you said pleasant things about me too, I think. That's different, it wasn't about me. What are you doing here anyway? Are you following me around? No one comes to Dark Grove. I thought I'd start my day off with a little self-terror. Beach washing your face with water. Finally, you make some sense. What are you up to? In case I've accidentally given you the impression that I'm a space scientist or something. I like to scavenge. It's what I do. I get into every nook and cranny and fish out the little artifacts the universe forgot about. Now, no one's stepped foot in dark grove in years. And this tower here is old. Like, really old. You can tell by the fact that there isn't a tower anymore. <laughs> but that didn't stop humans from using it anyway. At least until they up and left, tearing everything down behind them. So like a nerd in a board shop game board game shop, I dive right in, getting my little trinket fix. No one can tell me not to. I wouldn't dream of it. Is that how you got your jacket? Oh yes, my little green jacket. I found it in the White House up the mountain. I roll around in the garbage dump once a week to keep it fresh. Ooh. Well, I really like it. It's a nice don't say that. This whole thing, it's actually gotten pretty musty and I can't get the mud smell out of it. I should probably change this soon. You should have said it was awful. The picking's been slim in the old grub department. I I hope that at some point the bear is like, oh yeah, I hate it. Like to be not nice to him like he wants. And then he's like, oh, you really hurt my feelings. 
<laughs> that would be so funny. You wouldn't happen to have anything to gnaw on, would you? I could go make you something. Boy, I'd kill for an egg dippy. In fact, I'm pretty sure I have. There he goes. He's so cute. What's he doing? A little bready stick dipped inside a creamy egg would really hit the spot right about now. Hmm. Gus. Strange wooden leg. Feels like a skeleton could jump at me anytime. Oh, I really hope we make a spooky motel. That would be a dream come true. <laughs> that would be amazing. Well, I think I got most of everything here. Eggy dip it. <laughs> ah, much nicer. Whew. Very oppressive corner of the forest. Wow, the wind is intense. Look at all this wood. All mine. Take it. Ah, we have so many quests. So much to do. Um, okay, I really need to check in some new guests as well. All empty! Okay, 23 is a lot. 11, 23, 13, 23. Uh, God, the highest I have is 18. Bedroom 4. Is that this one? How can we improve it? 23. We need 5? I do have some trash, don't I? What if we just hang it up with like, f hang 5 small bear paintings in it? <laughs> floor lamp has, floor lamp has 3 decor. The medium rug is already in it, right? Simple mirror. This one is three as well. Maybe we can fit that in. That should be enough. We can fit that. It's already so late. Die the days are just the dyes are just flowing by. Days are flying by. an easy one. Um, I could put that... Oh, ooh, what am I doing? Oh, wait. Oh, no, I can't zoom. Oh, uh, they probably don't fit next to each other, do they? That should do it for that room. Right? I should be able to do, right? And I'll do this one. Okay. That's that place. How is the prestige? Has it gone up? Level three? Oh, it's like here? It needs to get to level four, right? Um, okay, we have two empty rooms here and the rest are leaving tomorrow. So we can basically book 
five people. Um, they're getting really high all of a sudden. 23 comfort. How many people can stay here? Accept any of those. Oh, we need to improve this place soon. Ah, I'm stuck. Okay. Cook one egg dippy. How do we cook? Maybe Julia will teach us. Now build a campsite. Okay, how do we do that? Let's see. Build a campfire. Okay, it needs to be four by four. Oh, it's fenced. I see. Okay. Campfire, sitting logs, and dispensers. Four seats? That's exactly what I had in mind. Is that the middle? It doesn't look like the middle. I guess it is. The night sounds are scary. Cute. <laughs> That's pretty cute. Okay. That... Did it, right? <laughs> can I sit at it? I don't think I can. Oh well. Julia, I got your stuff. <laughs> Hello again. I wasn't expecting you back. Did you find any sage? Got it right here. You really got some? Oh my, it really is. So musty and crisp. Did you really go all the way there to Dark Grove? Piece of cake. See, bears don't have to worry about underwear. Listen, if you're serious about getting this place back on its feet, I think I can help. The captain's family ate all sorts of food. They'd grow it in the garden and cook it down in the f into flavors you've never even dreamt of. Sweet, sour, buttery, earthy, smoky, tangy. Didn't know I could taste worse before. <laughs> and well, I know for a fact your humans are going to want some. So I can teach you how to do that, if you'd like to stick around. I would love to. Great. I mean, I'm happy to hear that. You can help yourself from the garden. Things grow f pretty fast in there, so help yourself. Okay. How are we gonna get our eggs, though? Where'd the chickens be? The captain had a big table the whole family would sit around. Ooh. Okay. You should probably give folks some room to eat. Dining rooms are rooms where your guests can consume meals. Craft and place a serving table, a table and the chair to make it functional and give food score. Meals added in the serving table will give out their food score to guests. Ooh, minus one. Guests will consume these meals usually three times a day. Each dining room will affect an entire building, so resorts of multiple buildings will require multiple dining rooms. Pfft. Raw ingredients will not award food score, only cooked meals will. Lower level serving tables have fewer slots available. Oh, I see. Okay. Build a functional dining room. What's this? Corn. Okay. 
What's this? Herbs. Okay, I have those. Turnips. Onion. Tomatoes. Potatoes. Little dinner. Stool recipe. Small table. Tiny buffet. One of those down. And then tables and stools that they can sit at. Food. Oh, kitchen and a dining room, obviously. Kitchen negatively affects the rooms near it. Looks like the house in Resi 7. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Wish you could move the stairs. Yeah. Well, how does the kitchen. The kitchen is 3x3. Three three. That's tiny. That's a tiny ass kitchen. Okay. So tiny. I wish I could move the door out of the way. I can't see. Ah, oh, it only fits three. I could put it against the wall, actually. Then we'll do that for now. Three guests. <laughs> I don't know what I want with this layout yet. did build a functional dining room. Yeah, I do have a storage chest. I know. Should just put some stuff in it. <laughs> I've been by myself for a long time. There's barely a soul that passes through here these days, except the ones that make a fuss at night, I guess. I don't have the guts to confront them. That sounds terrifying. Anyway, you got everything you need to start making some delicious food. Oh, except like the most, the one important bit, somewhere to cook. I did my best with what I had in the guest house, but I'm pretty proud of my little kitchen. Wholesale. Oh. Okay. Uh, you've unlocked a new crafting recipe. Cast iron stove. Cutting board. Cool. She's still sleeping. <laughs> it's morning! Now we can actually make it. Kitchens are rooms where you can cook meals. They require a cutting board, cooker, griddle, or microwave. Okay. Kitchen objects are noisy and smell funny, which means they carry a negative decoration score. Damn. Guests will not interact with kitchens, however, kitchens will apply a negative decoration score in an area affected around them. Okay, so we need to make sure rooms don't go near it. This debuff will affect any bedroom. Bedrooms built next to the kitchen. Okay. Place plenty of decorate decoration items to offset the negative effect of kitchen. Huh. You can see the debuff area by clicking on the room. Okay. Let's see how bad it is. Um... Oh, there. Cast iron stove. Puny, puny cutting board. That's it, right? That's the only thing I had to make. Oh, that's pretty big. Minus 25. Oof. And no one can stay here. Maybe we should just make this whole bit then a restaurant. Like, just pull it all the way down. Okay, let's see. Oh, we need to talk to Julia again. I can finish that one. And then we should check in with our motels. did get a kitchen. What are you waiting for? Time to give it its maiden voyage. I haven't exactly won any cooking competitions out there. 
Oh, nonsense. You're a natural. I can smell it on you. The smell is definitely all natural. Some basics to get you started. I'm sure not everyone's gonna be picky from the get-go. Grab some taters from the garden and some mint next to the lake. Give your new kitchen a spin. Welcome to cooking. Your goal is to follow recipes by matching ingredient items for cooking. Okay. Inter interact with any placed cooking object to bring up the cooking screen. Any objects in a kitchen will bring up the same interface. If you... You have to learn at least one recipe before you are able to access it. Okay. Each cooking object you place in the kitchen will give access to cooking cards. Okay. Higher level cooking objects will yield new cards and a larger number of overall cards. So if you make stuff, you unlock new stuff. Let's try it. So... Oh... Okay. How do I put it in? down the card in the cooking slot. Boil roast fuel. Oh. Okay, boil potatoes. Cook. Uh-huh. Oh my god. Do you think I'm making like 30? Okay, three. Uh, so that's that. I made three mashed potato. And there's mint tea as well. Uh, two mint foil. We have six, do it. Yeah, I used all of the potatoes, yeah. I mean, there's more potatoes in the garden right there, so... Okay. I cook. So, did I have a fridge I could make? Maybe I can store food in it? I got a new blueprint. Decoration minus five. Oh, it needs copper, though. Hmm. Oh, wait. Now we need to learn how to make egg dippy. <laughs> I sure did. You certainly did something. Better than my first try. Oh, thanks. Mm. Okay. Is that this? Egg dippy, egg dippy, boiled egg. Egg dippy! <laughs> okay, I, I should just buy everything, I think. I have the money. Recipes. Now it's empty. Good. So where am I gonna find eggs? I don't remember seeing any chickens anywhere. Egg dippy. Roast bread. And eggs. Okay, boil eggs. You buy them from the bodega. Ah. Oh. Wait, I have those. So can I store the food in here? <laughs> Is the buffet active now? Two percent coupon for our sister company, Flight or Fright. Cash or card. What is it? Dear value partner. Uh huh. 
Yes. Okay. Recent development into outdoor leisure for this property. Let's upgrade you to disregard. <laughs> Congratulations! <laughs> uh huh. Okay. So now we need to make rules. Oh! Stock update. Oh, <gasps> yes! Okay, that's good. Ooh! Cozy! Butterscotch bed recipe. Lovely lavender bed. Level three. Yes, 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 yes. Can I learn them here? Yes, 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 yes. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, let's go upgrade that bathroom. Um, so here? Uh-huh. How do we... Ah! Would you look at that? Was there anything else I needed except for eggs? Bread? Okay, that should be it for now. Eggs and bread. The music is quiet. That's what I thought, yeah. Okay. Oh, there's someone in there! You can't do that! He's grumpy. You gotta wait your turn, dude. Now he's happy. Oh! He naked! <laughs> dude, you gotta wait! There's only five people. It's not like it's taken all day. There he goes. <laughs> They're all- they all want to take their turn. Okay. Um... How much trash do I have? God, it gets so dark every time. Oh yeah, there were new items here too. Um, let's see. Here. Clean bathroom mirror. Oh, I have 163. Sensible towel rack. Ornate cabinet. Country wood shelf, walnut, walnut. Walnut cupboard, double rustic shelves, kitchen shelves, orderly wood pile, intricate medium rug. Ooh, I like that. Small cloudy painting, sensible coffee table. Ooh, a cuckoo clock. 150 though, that's a lot. Large forest painting. A medium stitched rug. Adirun Adirondack? I don't know what that is. Critter totem? <laughs> 230, that's so much. Fish plank. Pot plant, nice. A rocking sheep? Ooh! Round end table, rustic end table, small bear. Small bear carving. Terrarium? Oh, that'll be cool. Toolbox. Wall tapestry. Ooh, I like that. Autumnal met medium rug. Succulent plant. Chunky rustic lamp. And art deco. So many things. Oh, this is a chair. The carving. I see. Okay, first off, we're gonna fix that bathroom. I don't see... How do we get like a better shower and stuff? Oh, that was crafting, wasn't it? Oh, here, basic. Ugh, copper again. Okay, we need to find copper. I'll go to the garbage dump. It's so dark, I can't see. I can't see a thing. Hopefully there's some copper in here. Yes, there is. Great. Take it all. Nice. 
get all the copper. Okay, that should given should have given me some enough to uh, craft some, I think. Yes, that should do it. And everyone's asleep, so I can, like, do my renovations in peace? Is that a sink? Hmm. Okay. They're gonna wake up and be like, Oh, wow. Bathroom got an upgrade. Oh. Much better. <laughs> What's the rating now? Plus 18! We went from 9 to 18. Perfect. Um, I also got a better mirror. And the towel rack. How do I... Maybe I should put up the walls. Okay, there you go. Okay, and I have a little cabinet. Mm, that's a big cabinet. There. That's pretty nice. Too bad we have to look at it from the back, but at least now it's plus 18. That's good. Now we can accept better guests. Plus 18! Ho oh, ho ho ho! Yes! Uh, how are we doing? This one's empty. Oh, there's no requests right now. Leaves in two days, leaves tomorrow. Okay, well, at least that's great. Better bathroom. I was wondering if I can cook here now as well then, now that I know how. I guess I don't own the diner. Lamps for two bedrooms. Um, oh, you're right, they're just sleeping in the dark. <laughs> I didn't even realize. <laughs> well, sleeping in the dark is fine, but... They're living in the dark. They're just sleeping and I'm just coming in, planting a lamp and leaving again. There. Okay. We're doing good. The bare minimum has been acquired. Okay, I want to cook an egg dippy. <laughs> Let's do it for Gus. Oh, there's so much trash here. Back to High Lake. All of a sudden the trailers make sense. They really do. Dude just comes in, plops something down and leaves again. <laughs> totally. Okay, time to cook. Egg dippy. Um. Egg dippy. Wait, where, do, where are my cards? Oh, here. Fuel. Roast the bread. And boil the eggs. Egg dippy, egg dippy, egg dippy. I'm so excited. I bought the eggs from um, the little store on A24. Egg Dippy! I'm coming, Gus! He's gonna be so happy! Uh, I mean mad! Okay, where is he again? Darkwood? It's so dark though, I can barely see anything. It's really messing with my eyes. Yes! Fresh out of the kitchen! Salty, savory, creamy, delicious! Tastes like I'm about to do something useful. You make a mean egg dippy, big boy. <laughs> Thanks, I didn't lay it, only cooked it. We used to get egg dippy. Oh, shit. My poor ma, I don't blame her. She did the best she could. We were 12 brothers and she had to carry us all on her back. Literally. And we were all little dumbasses too, <laughs> driving her up the wall. Oh man, I don't think my mom could have handled more than one Hank. 
I remember one time my two older brothers and I got up in the middle of the night to steal the pudding. And we accidentally dropped the whole bowl from the third floor. I swear her mouth was spouting fire. I thought I was for sure dying that night. I wasn't allowed out of the hole for three days straight. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't even the longest I got put in the hole. Did she ever put you someplace nice when you did something good? Like a shelf up high or somewhere? What? No, that's dumb. Besides, I don't remember doing something good. Like, ever. It was like we were 12 devils put on this earth to torment her. And boy, were we good at it. I don't know, I remember doing a lot of dumb things, but I don't think we ever had a hole. Yeah? Well, how did you get punished? Forced to eat dish soap? The old stick over the paw? I hated that one. She usually sat down with me and told me what I did wrong. Usually felt bad enough to apologize and never do it again. Oh. I see. That's dumb. Hey, you know what? When you're done scavenging, I think I could use some help with the humans. Oh? Yeah, see, I'm not a big people bear. <laughs> and I was thinking, I need someone with some heart, some zing. Hmm. And, don't get me wrong, you have a lot of stinky energy. Damn right. But maybe that's exactly what I need from someone running my concierge stand. Concierge? 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 Do you mean that? Of course. I could use someone scaring some mustaches off a few folks for a fair price. Well, that's one of the least dumb things you've ever said you've said today, Hank. Listen, if I come and help you, I'll need my own little table with my own little chair. <laughs> Always the undeniable people possum. Gus had offered his services as a concierge. I don't know, I'll say it. I Sounds good. All he asked for was a little stand through which he could take care of business, of course. A perfect position for such a charming individual. Listen, if I come and help you, I'll need my own little table with my own little chair. Deal! Okay, that's great. So great. I'm excited. This is awesome. You're awesome! <gasps> don't like that. You don't like that. Gus's concierge stand recipe. <laughs> Thanks, Hank. Oh, he did like it. <laughs> okay. You've learned the blueprint for Gus's stand. Place him anywhere in a resort to unlock his services for that area. You can turn on his services through the cabin management screen. He will automatically accept new guests to any bedroom you indicate, saving you the need to do it manually. However, Gus won't be as good as you at matching bedrooms the guests need. So choose which rooms you ask him to manage carefully. Oh. Every bedroom Gus manages will cost a fixed number of coins per day. If you run out of coins, the service will stop automatically and you will need to turn it back on yourself. Likewise, if you edit the staff item or the rooms it affects, the service will stop and you will need to turn, turn it on automatically. Or manually. Wait, that's kind of confusing. So... Basically, he's only good if you know the room is so good that it will never be not good enough for people. Yeah, so he can kind of like run a business while I'm gone. But the place basically needs to run itself. Like he can't decide like, oh, this guest will be good for this room or this guest won't be good for this room. Congrats, Hank. There's no one staying at it yet, but the food's there. You just cooked your first batch of food for someone else. That's nothing to sneeze at. Now you better make sure there's always food in there for folks to eat. You can make the same stuff, sure, but you'll run out of ingredients quick. You better learn how to cook more stuff than mash and tea. Got plenty of recipes from the captain's cookbook. Come by my little booth sometime. I, I already bought all of them. Okay, I guess we should get this place ready for guests. Start making some rooms. What can we do with this as well? What else can we make here? Campfire. Dining, kitchen, bathroom. And a bedroom. Hmm. I guess that's it for this area. Maybe I should have made it bigger then. Oh well. 
Um, so yeah, maybe we should edit this. Since the kitchen is gonna affect this whole area anyway. We could just like... Make it like that. And then this is like a hallway. Because the kitchen is gonna mess it up anyway. No, the travesty. There you go. Now we're safe. Okay, minus 25. Goddamn! Maybe we should put... Oh yeah, we can make a better... Buffet thing. I really wish you could filter this by room. Like, not just functional or decorative. I want, like, bedroom or kitchen. I mean, I know it has the icon, but still. Oh yeah, the refrigerator. So that's just to store things? What am I looking for? Oh, this. Okay. Um... Let's put that here. Better. There is hardly any space. <laughs> this is a tiny kitchen. Oh, this is a very tiny unit. Okay. Okay. Then our buffet is a bit bigger now. Maybe we should put the some of the other tables back in. Is it this line? Well, actually, I'll just put it here. I keep thinking I want to have it lower. It's not too bad, honestly. And it needs like a ton of decorations, but for the base level, I think that's okay. Um, now where do I get... Where do I get my Took stuff? Where did he go? Oh, now the fun begins! Shopping! <laughs> I only have 97 though, so we have to be pretty smart with this. Like, this rug is 40 and gives 2, but... This one costs 14, so less, much less, but also gives 2. This one costs only 10 and gives 2, so we're definitely starting out with this one. Um, I'll get 4. The lamp is three, so they're good. I do really like the jukebox. I kind of want another one, but... Can't get much. Um, how about a plant? Yeah. Okay. And then we'll start making beds. And rooms. So how do we switch to upstairs? How do we go up? Ah, there. Should we start upstairs? And we need a bathroom. Ooh, that's gonna be tricky. Because I'm sure if we build a bathroom downstairs, then it's not gonna reach upstairs. Yeah, it, it means we need two bathrooms, probably. Two rooms and a bathroom upstairs, yeah. Ooh, okay, well, let's make some beds first. Level three. Okay, looks like we're not short on anything. 
do we want? What color scheme do I want? Well, I am going with the red carpet. That doesn't really matter. Elegant wardrobe. Ugh. I like the wardrobes, but I, I'm worried how big they are. Oh, I don't even have the iron nails. Never mind. Uh, cute, comfy footrest. Okay, so we're gonna pro probably going to have to make two bathrooms, right? Copper again. Oh, I forgot. No. Okay. So you walk up the stairs like this, right? So they come up here, like this end. Let me test it. Yeah, so they come up there. Oh yeah, I was figuring out this layout. Okay, so if the stairs, if they come up here, we could make this whole bit into a room. Like that. And then put... Oh, that's maybe a bit too big. We can maybe divide. This is the same bullshit from before. Damn it. Oh, uh. Remove it. But now we're gonna. Have, yeah, we're gonna be left with the door. How do I? How do I work with this? Damn it! Leave. Absolutely. Bathroom has to be in the middle. The problem is the staircase. So if I want to make this one, one, two, three, four, and then do the bathroom like this, and then that whole bottom bit can be like one big room. I think I'll do that. So that will be the bathroom. This will be one big bedroom. Cannot build a room around stairs. Damn it. Ruining my party. Could do that. Quite unusual, but that looks cozy. One really nice room coming right up. <laughs> and that's all I have. <laughs> the honeymoon suite. Yeah. Um, and then, okay, make that. Ooh, yes. And then I'll make one last room in this remaining space. Like that. That's pretty good, I think. Hmm. Yeah. And then we'll put some more stuff there as well. Um, like we can put maybe another rug here or a cabinet or something. Oh yeah, I forgot. I have this as well. Nice. Nice, nice. And it reaches both rooms. Perfect. Okay. Step one is done, but we need copper, so we'll probably just go back to 824 again. I think the comfort rating needs to go up, but I don't really know how to do it. Thirteen eight. What's this? Fourteen hygiene. I can deal with fourteen hygiene. 
Um, is the rest leaving tomorrow? They are. Okay, so we can assign people to every room. The people with higher standards, they give um, more money, right? <laughs> Hygiene rating of one. He's just like, as long as I have a place to take shit, I'm good. <laughs> Thirteen five eight. That takes care of everything, I think. Actually, I'm thinking the timber place is probably going to be empty, isn't it? I should probably assign everything there as well. Oh, their standards are going to go up. Our oh, 23? Do I have a 23 room? Yes, I do. Um, twelve ten. Fourteen. I can't do fourteen. Mm, okay. So is the comfort level just like the bed? get the level of the bed up. They do look very cozy. <laughs> Their rooms are so full of stuff. <laughs> you can't admit. You have to say they look pretty cozy, right? Got any trash? Bed, wardrobe, footstool, vanity. Bed, wardrobe, footstool. Okay. Bed. Oh, the wardrobe. Oh, yeah. Three, three. Three comfort. The bed is ten comfort. Yeah, I think my problem is just that the rooms are too tiny. Now, at this point, it's like you kind of want to just have the guests in there. That's... I remember now. I was gonna like fill up the space, bring this room down, and then make this one bigger. So I have two big rooms on the right. That was why we had the two empty. Now I remember. I can make them bigger after this lot. Well, I just entered new guests, didn't I? Four small rooms to three medium rooms. Oh. Could do that too, yeah. Oh, I forgot BB was in the room. <laughs> I just scratched the scratcher. <laughs> he scared me. What you doing, round boy? How you doing? He had a good nap. He was in that little basket thing. That. Um. Was time. Oh, time doesn't move when you're building. That's good. Because <laughs> that was just, I just left it. Um, can we like. Can we cancel guests? You can kick them. Should we? Should we. Oh, yeah, if we edit the room, we can kick them out, right? Aniela is staying there. We can she's checking out tomorrow morning though. Maybe we should maybe we should wait till morning and then have collect her money and then why can't I do that? Oh. Collect her money and then prevent the other guests from coming. Sleep. <laughs> Sleep right in front of the door. Okay. There they go. Okay, what if... Okay, let me... 
What if we, like, do it super quick now before the new guest even arrives? Okay. Um... Is this the... Oh yeah, two more days. This is already the new guest. So, I guess I'll... I'll just kick him out. Should we do it? He says the entire resort is kind of cheap. Kick him the fuck out. Be gone with you. Okay. Okay. So... So you want to give like one row to that top room? Because this is... One... This room is only two rows right now. This one is four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Oh, so it's not gonna be even anyway. I guess I'll do that and then edit this room. I need to click on it though. There. There. There we go. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Don't want the rug. Maybe I should put the rug away for a sec just because so it's not in the way. It's driving me insane. Um, this big wardrobe. It's so ugly. Do you think maybe we have enough space? Oh! <gasps> That's pretty good. Maybe we can make this one room super fancy then. Where am I gonna put things? Ooh, maybe, ooh. Maybe. So this thing is cozy. Um, so anything else that's cozy as well? I don't think so. Oh, this. Um, I could just put it here. Maybe this window needs to go up a little bit. It's not too bad, honestly. What's the cozy? Oh, we're now at 21 cozy. And a better bed. Oh, that's true. I can just make a better bed. Because this one's in it now. This is comfort 10. This is comfort 15. What am I doing? Get in here. Oh, big bed. Move over. Oh, this is a really big bed. Oh, uh, now my strat doesn't work with this thing. Oh, my inventory's full! No! <laughs> oh my god, my life is pain. Pain and suffering. Okay. Get in there, massive-ass bed. Who do you think you are? Level 15 cozy or something? Okay, what if... It's so ugly, but it works. This room is now 26 cozy. Okay, what if... I'll just move the rug, like, here. It's so ugly. It's like blocking the window, even. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> okay. It's just happening. That's just how we're gonna do it. Um, so now the room is 2226. Add a good light. Do you think that light fits here? <gasps> oh! Um, nice, 2526. If I had that big plant, this one. Ooh, 
This is plus two. Yeah. What do you think? Left corner or right corner? I think this is probably good. Now the room is 26 comfort, 27 decorations. Sideways next to the door wardrobe. Could. This one is three. Oh, it's not that big. Uh, what's the. I can't even see. That's. Okay, so facing this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's good. 2631. Okay, I think this room is done. Oh, <gasps> the clock! <laughs> Possum clock. 2635. Bam. This room is done. It's filled with shit, but people will love it. Okay, now let's do a normal room here. Um, the rest of the rooms doesn't have to be anything too crazy, I think. Although I would actually... Hmm. The problem is that this bed is so big. I think we're gonna stick with these beds for this place. But we could put another vanity in here if we want to. We do have room for vanity, like this. Put these on the same like level same row so this room now I can't really tell can I can't bring up a list or anything right and look that way oh here I got it 13 comfort 19 decoration if I these two together where'd the light go are three. Oh, okay. So it's the same. Okay. Although I could, instead of a light, I could put a plant on there and then put one of the lights here. That's kind of cute. We are now at 15 comfort, 23. 23 is good. I think some guests are 23. Um, okay, let me... Let's people move out. Okay, now I can actually see. I think this room is the best. That's great. But now these rooms need more. Definitely need more. They're so tiny, dude. Should we break this up into one room? Should we keep two tiny rooms for people with low standards? You know? Oh, is this just standing on the floor? How did that get there? Okay, there. Which is more profit? Ooh. I actually don't know how to look at what they pay. Oh yeah, we're still trying to get this... Oh, to level 4, right? Oh, we're almost there! Just a couple more decorations. Hmm. <laughs> I do that. Can do this. Oh, we're so close. There's more low standards. Okay. You mean like it's good to. 
that's pretty good. I could put this here <laughs> and then put one big one here. Oh god, we're so close. <laughs> what do I do? Four. That's it. That little stool did it. Don't I have another lamp? Yeah. There. <laughs> God, this place is packed. It does... I have to say, it does look a lot better like this. It looks a lot more, like, organized. Okay. Now we need to let more guests in. Oh, <laughs> I blocked myself out. I don't fit. I'm too big. Ugh, but then it's in the middle. Is it- if I take like one thing out, is it immediately too low? Okay, no, we're still- That should be good. Yes. Okay, let's- ooh, the luxurious room! 26 comfort! Yeah, now we can let in the people that want 23. There. Nice. 14, 13. You can go in that room. And then the last room is 10, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Nice. Um, finally did that. Awesome. Hehehe. <laughs> I get a bad review? Probably, because I kicked two people out. Cool. Build one level three bedroom. Hosts plus two guests with a pamper trait. Okay, I feel like we're doing that already. It doesn't have to be on the same day, right? Oh yeah, look, we already have part of the requirement. Host two ghosts with two guests with the pamper tree. Okay. Great. Awesome. Complete this day for six guests in High Lake. Ten guests in A24. How are we doing on that? some trash. Nice solid improvement for a timber crossing. Now let's see. This seems so empty in comparison now. I do have a fancy bed on me, don't I? Two more. Tempting. Put random stuff in the rooms. Anyone want a mirror? Mm, they already have mirrors. Our biggest problem was that we need copper. Let's see if the the dump has some new stuff. Ba -bum. Ba -bum. Yes, it does. Let's see if we can find some copper. Yes, that was copper. Two copper. Four copper total. Five. Six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Good, good, good. Mm. Okay. Now I can make some bathrooms. Bathroom utilities. Uh, high leak. 
We still just need to get this place up and running. I really am curious how far this is gonna go. Like, if at some point Hank is just making like a million at a time. Or like you have more than a million money on you. Because it's just... You're making so much money every day from everything. Okay, the bathroom. This place is so much bigger. Now I'm used to our first motel again and I'm like, whew, much bigger. Oh, wrong button. Let's click. We want a modest toilet. Okay, great. Um, where did we make like the towel rack and stuff? Oh, we get that from Took, don't we? Go get some more bathroom stuff. Bathroom mirror, towel rack, and the cabinet. Oh, and the little rug. There we go. Oh, I can't afford it. Never mind. But at least we have enough to get started. Very little, honestly. <laughs> That'll have to do. But now we can have guests here, I think. Oh, what's the oh the food is plus three. Campfire. Oh, this is so weird. New things. Okay. So these people want the campfire. Let's see. Decoration needs to be 15. Food needs to be 2. Hygiene 4. Comfort 10. Okay. I think we're covered on all grounds then. Um, how about this lady? Yes. Nice. Our first two guests. All they can eat is potato mash and tea. <laughs> no money for lights. Nope. Well, they have they have lights at least in their rooms. Campfire. There's no light in the kitchen though. Do I really have nothing? Five. Oh, I might be able to afford one lamp. The kitchen will be dark, but... Yes. Um... I'll get this one. Now I'm really broke. Meatballs to the mash. Good idea. One light. <laughs> and now I'm really, really broke. I need to find more trash. Where can I find more? I guess if more guests stay here. I wish they would just put all their trash in one spot though. Okay. So we're working on that. First two guests are coming. Hamper trait. We'll look into that in a couple days. I guess that's it, isn't it? Now we just need to walk around and try and find trash. I'm excited for our new guests to come. I think they'll like the big room. My room. <laughs> the executive suite. Inside the bathroom in the hallway. Oh, you're right. Look at all those people going about their day. <gasps> he 
just went and take took a shower while she was still on the bathroom on the toilet they did not give a shit <laughs> oh hey I guess so what did I do I don't know <laughs> number of guests build two level one bathrooms two level one bathrooms why would you want two Ooh, bigger inventory though. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. No, ah, damn it. There. Build two bathrooms. But my layout is perfect. Separate the one bathroom. Make it two tiny bathrooms. That's smart. Put an extra door on the side. Oh, you're smart. You're very smart. I could- ooh, okay. I'll move this down a tiny bit so we can expand one down and then just make it two. Make it bigger. Okay. Oh, I like what you're cooking with. If only I could put that on the thing. Not sure. Not sure where the division is. <laughs> that looks so messy. Uh, wait. It's two and three. Minimum is three and three. Oh, it needs to be three wide. You're right. Build a tiny extra one and then delete it afterwards. That's what I did. Oh, you can delete it again. I guess you could. Yeah. Yeah, I would I would leave it in place because I have been noticing that like they've been grumpy because there's not enough bathrooms to use. Give me the towel. <laughs> right above the toilet. Put the front desk in the right hallway. Do two bathrooms horizontal. Oh, I just finished it. Make the front right room smaller and add an ensuite could do that. Like here, three by three. Ooh. That might kind of work. Wouldn't it make sense to have bedrooms, be bedrooms in each corner? A bathroom between the top and lower on each side. Have the bar in the middle. Oh my god. That would make a lot of sense. That would make a lot of sense, but that also means we have to Rearrange everything. <laughs> That's a lot of work. I guess we could delete everything and just rearrange it. Clean slate. Kick everyone out who's staying here right now. Or should we wait? Maybe we should wait for people to check out and then then rearrange everything. One room's empty ready. Everyone leaves tomorrow. Okay, here's the deal. We're gonna wait for everyone to check out tomorrow, then we'll delete everything and rearrange it like you said, because it makes a lot more sense. Bedroom, bathroom, bedroom. Bedroom, bathroom, bedroom. Same way, bar in the middle. Bars! That'll work. Um, what's the rest on our timber crossing? We need two pampered guests. I don't think... I think we just booked in all new people, so we probably can't do that, but... But trash. This is such a cozy place now. They leave tomorrow? We actually have empty rooms. Okay. So, pampered... How do we do that? Is pamper trait like if they're really happy with their stay? Perfect reviews, 24. Oh, host kicked me out. 
No reason supplied. I'm a bear. Little icon to the left of accept. This. Or is this just any of these is good? Green pillows, pampered. 38. Oh, I see. Oh, wait. Do we even have 38? 26 is the highest I... Oh, wait. Yeah, isn't 26 the highest I have? Yeah. 38? So we thought 26 was great, but we need 12 more. So I don't overlevel the site. Yeah, I, I mean, I think I can't do any... I don't think I can do any more stuff for now. I'll just accept the other guests. 23 I can do. 2023. 20, can I? Yeah. Can't do 17.9 though. Hmm. Oh wait, that's the room. Yeah, I can't accept any of these. Well, that's that. We'll just leave that for now then. We do have some trash, so we could... A little bit, I think. 60. We could get a couple items together. Where did, did you dump any trash up here? We could get a couple items together for um, the place up north. Oh. Hmm. A sensible coffee table, perhaps? I think we were missing bathroom stuff, right? Um, I'll take the bus quicker. Yeah, let's see if there's any food. Have they been eating it, you think? Oh, I can't reach the... Oh god, design flaw. I can't fit. Oh, they haven't eaten it yet. So I think we're good. <laughs> He's sleeping. Oh, he awake. Yeah, we need... I need the rug. Is that it? You can make a level 1 bathroom using your bathroom stuff in storage. That's true. For the other place, yeah, that'll be fine. I want... I want... This. I do kind of want that. The rest we have, right? I'll get another large plant. I like those. Tiny rug. Plant. Actually, put it in the... Change my mind. did that. Here's the other bathroom stuff. <laughs> so sad. Um, did, I need a, did I need a logger's tool for anything? Was there anything we could have fixed somewhere? Sleep time. It is time to remodel. So... I delete the room, and then everything goes to my inventory, right? You don't need to delete everything. 
that's true. I do want to delete this one. This side needs to go. <sighs> yes. Okay. Ha. Oh, that looks good. I'm happy with that. <laughs> okay. Now. Bedroom. It's five by three, right? I think so. That's one. Should we put a nice bed in? Could do that. Maybe I could make the I could make the top rooms nice. Oh, that doesn't stack. Hmm. Why not? Oh, my inventory's full. That's why. Okay, so we're gonna make two bathrooms. One crappy and one nice. <laughs> okay, there we go. That's all the crappy stuff. Where's the bathtub? Didn't I have a bathtub? Oh, it's probably in Lost and Found. stuff that I have. Make space. <laughs> That's so tiny. There we go. Okay. That's good looking. I like that. Hehe. <laughs> another room. I want the window. Um, and then a bed. There. Turns out I completely misunderstood the assignment. <laughs> Is that the same height? Yeah, okay. I want it the same on both sides. Okay, and then the weird distillery. Like here. Ooh, that's satisfying. Bathroom doors are at different heights. Oh yeah, they are. What's the middle? I don't think there is a middle. Let's just put it left in. Forget what was in this room. Oh, just stools now. Oh, the jukebox is in here. Cool. That is so much better. The <laughs> right bathroom, though. I would not want to stay there. <laughs> can do another bedroom above it. If you make the super tiny, you mean? 
Do they not have... Oh, wait. Let me um, take those. Okay. It's gotten a lot more complicated today, don't you think? Compared to the first stream we did. Oh, but you have the nice bed. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. I should put the nice beds in this room because it's bigger. Nicest room then. Ugly. Ugly. <laughs> I will not allow it. Didn't we have? Oh, I guess I just don't have it here. I remember having nicer things than this, but I'm just low on stuff, I think. We could put more stuff in the walls and like little plants on stools and things, but this room is now 25, 21, 18. So it's not the layout works so well. Yeah, it's very satisfying to look at. I like it. I'll move this a tiny bit. Could put another plant here. We can upgrade this bathroom later if we want. Make it all nice. This is much better. Build two level one bathrooms. Why is it not? It doesn't say we completed it. Are we missing something? Bathroom 2, level 1. Bathroom 1, level 2. Wait, they both have to be level 1? That doesn't make any sense. So I need to make more crappy things? That doesn't make any sense. Now I just have to craft crappy things that I don't want. Dang it. That's copper, too. Precious copper. Make it crappy. So now we've done it. Yes. We get the oh, fatty pack. Cute. Can I equip it? Oh, it's just a permanent. Uh, oh, that would be nice though, because we have been struggling. <gasps> so much space. Everything fits in the fanny pack. <laughs> Restore everything. Okay, that's good. Yeah. I'll stash this stuff. Oh, not that one. Uh, these. Okay. Now let's see what he wants next. Three level three bedrooms. 
Okay. What are they? What level is this? Level three. Level three. <gasps> I just need one more like that. Hmm. Do you think it's just it just takes a level three bedroom? You can make one different. Make it butterscotch. Forget what needs to change. Oh, uh. I don't even know if it'll fit. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, bud. What level is it now? Level three! Haha, <laughs> I did it! Although I just get money, right? <laughs> no time for vacation. Okay. That's enough of that for a little bit. Oh, we should book guests in. Money, 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 money. Renovation complete. Ooh, 23. I don't know if I can do that. Do I have a room that has 23? I do. Um, 813. What's this? Higher than average hygiene score. Oh, 14 is a little bit much. What am I at? Nine, okay. Seven, eight, five. Yes. Okay, booked in. Money, please. Procedure level four. Isn't it already four? Yeah. One level three bathroom, okay. We don't have anything for that yet, so. Hygienic tree. Hmm. Okay. So that we'll have to wait on for a bit. That suggestion was great to just put this in the middle and then mirror this. I like it. <gasps> Trash did for you. Let's get that copper. streaming <gasps> over four hours what this game this is like stardew all over again it's like just do this little one little thing i'll just get this little thing then i'm done uh, maybe maybe i'll do this little thing then i'm done i am excited though to play more nobody saves the world with sean that was very fun oh i missed one Good. Need my heart rare. Maybe we should check if the motel. Let's let's go motel by motel. I I want to check if the top one needs food. Check Timber Crossing first. Trash. Thank you. Appreciate it. It's so cozy. You think everyone's happy? Wait, wait, let me check here. Oh, empty leaves tomorrow. Okay, we need to book in people. Oh yeah, this was our problem. Comfort level's so high. I wonder if that means that... Uh, maybe we should go down to three bedrooms so that they're bigger and we can fit more stuff in it. Oh, we already did that though. But maybe, yeah, maybe we should merge these and then put the same stuff in it. Maybe later though, I feel like 
Because we decked out that one room the best we could and it's still not good enough. That's our highest we can do right now, 26-ish. So if they want 38, we're just, we just don't have the right stuff. Seventeen. Fifteen. Wait, or? Seventeen. You get the nice room. Eight. Fifteen. Oh, I can do this one too. Thanks. Okay. Um, so. How are the guests doing? How are they feeling? So many icons. Now, now I realize there's gonna be two more categories. That's gonna be so complicated. Uh, leaves tomorrow, empty. Okay. Wait. Oh, I thought it was the same lady. Looks the same, different name. Um, 23, 12. Can we do that? No, our highest is 20 comfort. So we can't accept them. We can do 14. And then they only... Uh, the comfort's so high and then decoration, they're like, yeah, four is fine. <laughs> um, yeah, that's good, right? Oh no, they expect four food. I could do that. I just need to make sure... I make some more. I cook some stuff. Ooh, seven. Let's not do seven. Eleven, three, four. Okay, thirteen. I think that's okay. I think I just need to make sure I cook some stuff. A lot of space. I forgot. Let's see what we can make with. We can also put the tea in, I think. The mushrooms and the herbs, onion, sage, tomatoes. I don't know if you can eat lilies. Let's see what we can cook. What? Do we want to try and make? Oh, strawberry. There were strawberries out there. Oh, look. Oh, now I see the rating. Corn on the cob is a three rating. So does that make any to? Does that mean I need to make something tomato soup with a four rating? Milk. I need some milk. Okay, we could make soup, roasted potato, butter. Okay, milk, butter. Egg dippy. Okay, we need milk and butter. Let's go shopping. Milk and butter. Milk, milk and butter. Must not forget. Milk and butter. Milk, butter. Milk, milk and butter. I should just right click. I'll get two. Cheese. Just because. I like cheese. Yeah, I think I have this. Okay. We start off with the fuel. Okay, two tomatoes. We boil them. You boil milk? How do I how do I split the stack again? There. I don't know if I did that correctly. I shift clicked like in Stardew and it worked. Okay. <laughs> I want two. And then I need the raw herbs. Okay, so that's just like that. Um, that's that. Okay, and just one. There. Cook it.
I just made one though. I should probably make more, shouldn't I? Yeah, why wouldn't I just make as much as I can? Um, and some roasted potatoes. Okay. Raw. I'm just gonna put everything in this time. See how much I can make roast. Two things. Butter. Oh, it's just gonna make two. But that's fine. Potatoes. Did I not bring my potatoes? I'm getting it eventually. I'll get there. Okay. Second try. Roast the potato. We want herbs. We want fuel. We want potatoes roasted. And we want butter. Cook that. Hope you can make fries. <laughs> yeah, that would be fun. So how does it work with the fridge? I can just store four things. That's not a lot. Milk, cheese, and tomatoes and the corn. Um, take my potatoes. So does that upgrade? I hope I did it right. Does that upgrade the status? What's my status for my kitchen? 11? It's cumulative. <gasps> Great. Oh, that's so much better than I expected. So, oh, for, so I made 12. Wait, that doesn't make sense. Wasn't the rating 11? I think I need to get rid of that one stool so I can walk around it. Oh yeah, this is three. Oh. Oh, there's one gone. Okay, so it depletes but very slowly. You can basically just stuff it with food and then forget about it for a long time. Get out of here. You stool. There. That should help. Oh yeah, I forgot to add the tea. Did I have tea? You are right. Yeah, now I can just access everything. Okay. This place is still very much under construction, but we're getting there. The guests are having a good time. I do remember seeing strawberries somewhere on the map. Where was that? We had strawberries somewhere. Oh, here. Okay, I want strawberries. Where are they? <gasps> there. Yes, strawberries! What did we need to make the strawberry thing? A strawberry bowl. Oh, it's just strawberries, just like that. That's easy. Nothing else. Egg dippy. <laughs> okay. Raw. That's easy. So you can always put like a bowl of strawberries in a bowl of apples. The rating is not great, but it's something. Because I saw apples as well, I think. Or something. Yeah, apple bowl. <laughs> Egg dippy. 
That, that reminds me of the uh, maple syrup. <laughs> oh, that's a lot. Oh, they don't stack. Can I just put two things in there? Okay. There. It's not great, but it'll do for now. You gonna go eat? She going in. She gonna do it. She's getting the food. They're both eating. Are you gonna sit at the table? <gasps> Look at that! <laughs> oh wait, I could have zoomed in. Yeah. Oh, is she going for a nap? Great idea. A little noon nappy. <laughs> Well, I think we're... we made some good progress, right? We got a new area again? God, there's still a lot. I want the beach area. I think that'll be... Oh, and then we can start making, like, clam chowder or something. I'm sure. That would be great. I wonder what all of this in between is as well, because I feel like these just connect, right? But... Like when we go south from Timber Cross and we just end up here immediately, but there seems to be stuff in between. Maybe, I don't know, maybe they won't show this. Maybe it's just this and this area. Beach resort, yes. Maybe that's that'll be like a, a stranded ship that will be turned into a motel. That would be awesome. I do really want to make a ghost house too. Like a haunted motel? Ah, oh, that would be so fun! I don't know. Maybe DLC if it's not in the main game. We'll see. <laughs>